Check it out, I am all tie-dyed. Assalamu alaikum and welcome to Noor Kids Crafters. I'm your host Ellen and this is the show where we make awesome crafts for kids. So today, I am showing you how I made this whole tie-dye outfit, both the shirt and hijab. This one's a great back-to-school craft because it's nice to do outside and you can show off your cool stuff to your classmates. I'm going to start off with a classic white t-shirt. First, I'm going to show you how to tie this. There are a lot of patterns you can do, but my favorite starts off with laying it flat and then taking part of it and twisting it up like this until the whole shirt starts to twist. Then I'm gonna take another part and twist that as well. Next, twist it all together, curl up the sleeves, and make it all into one big ball. All right, so next you're gonna get out your rubber bands and rubber band it in three different places because I'm gonna use three colors of dye. By the way, I like to keep the t-shirt just a little bit damp, but not super wet. All right, there we go. Now we're going to get out our bowl or bucket, and we are going to cover it with dye. And I'm going to use the triangles on the rubber bands as guidance here. Then flip it over, and you may need to adjust the rubber bands. The triangles don't have to be perfectly even, but, you know, they should be triangles. And now put some more dye on there in the same pattern that you did on the front. If you add more dye, there's going to be more color, and if you add less dye, there's going to be more white. All right, that looks good. So now I'm going to put that in a bag and set it aside. Now for the hijab, I'm going to do a different pattern. I'm going to start off by loosely folding it back and forth like this, and then folding it over on itself. Next, I'm going to add rubber bands on two ends. So it looks almost like a piece of candy. Then I am going to dye each end. And try to leave the middle a little bit blank. Put this in a plastic bag as well and leave both to dry. After a little while, you're going to want to take it out of the bag and unfold it. But once it's dry, you can go ahead and wear it. And that is how I look like this now. <laughs> That is all for today, but before you go, please make sure to give this a like and subscribe for more awesome crafts. Jazakallah khair and assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.